today I am showing how to show the boot menu after the installation of PrimeOS. Many of the systems are not showing the boot menu after the installations. So uh, I have shown the show how to show this boot menu. Uh, basically, uh, the boot menu will come automatically, uh, but sometimes it will not come. So we will look how to show the boot menu. First of all, we need two apps. App name is Disk Genius and ECBCD. Okay, these two apps link are posted below. You can download it. First of all, you need this. First of all, we need to uh, the uh, partitions for the primary used to be ext4. So how we I will show how to create an ext4 partition okay right here and click disk management okay we can see the this is my partition ext4 partition first create and click string volume and give the wonder type you want to give uh, uh, 16 GB or 20 GB and click string after that open disk genius app okay here this is all partitions it is already ext4 but you know how to create ext4 just click format current partition and set it as ext4 and click format that's all after that um, plug the flash drive of primos and install the primos you know, in the installation process after the selection of partition click do not format okay then install it this one way after that i will show how to show the boot menu in our system to enter the prime OS. first of all you need to enter this app disk genius open it okay here you will see the partition that you given for primos open it and you will see a option grab click and open it here you will see menu dot first a first file right click and click copy to desktop click complete then close it so we will get a file dot menu menu okay right click and open with wordpad after opening the wordpad you will get a window like this showing this codes commands okay then you want to check default zero try to prime voice okay you want to copy from default from first to dot img we don't want a debug mode or anything we we just want this okay then copy then close the window okay then after that open ecbcd click yes okay we will get a window like this here you, you can see in edit mode menu only windows 10 okay now we want to add primaries click add new entry 
and go to neo grep okay neo grep then click install okay then this will install one side of that we will see a configure button click on configure button okay here there will be some writings we we want to clear it and become a blank page and uh, right click and uh, paste the copied thing here and uh, click fire and uh, save this okay then close this window after that go to edit boot menu and click new grab boot loader and rename rename as prime os okay then click here and click on wait for user selection or countdown from down from this option i i will recommend to choose this option wait for user selection and click save settings okay save settings that's all now we will check by re restarting click restart okay wait for restart okay it's restarting okay now check we have two options on the boot menu windows 10 and prime os click just click prime os we will lead to this page here we will see option prime os once again i don't know the exact coding of according to how to get directly but if we click the prime os we will load to this booting you see this works booting just wait yes you can see the logo of the prime os Just wait for the loading. Yes, wait. Prime OS is start. That's all guys. Thanks for watching my video.